Tuscaloosa City leaders are taking another stand on overcrowding issues on game day weekends along the university corridor. You might recall that the city recently passed a queuing ordinance for people outside of bars and restaurants. Well, now they're making sure everything is up to code on the inside of those establishments as well. ABC's 3340's Aaron Wise is joining us now. Aaron, a recent letter to business owners from the city attorney said they're already having cases of overcrowding inside as we get into the heart of football season. Stephen, in that letter, the city attorney went on to explain the consequences for being over capacity. They include being closed immediately for 24 hours and the ability to arrest owners, managers or any staff responsible for the overcrowding. The letter emphasizes a zero tolerance policy moving forward. Tuscaloosa Fire Marshal Patrick Steins tells me they've shut businesses down in the past because of overcrowding. Now there's increased concern about the problem crowding inside and outside. So it's a combination of how do we handle both? Uh, because, you know, when you're exiting a building onto a public way that's not crowded, then, you know, people are flowing freely and things like that. Now, when the crowd gets dense along the public way, then now we get into some, some issues of being able to get people out of buildings fast enough. Now I asked Tuscaloosa police how they would enforce arrest if overcrowding continues. TPD says they have a number of officers along the strip Thursday through Saturday looking for these types of violations. Live in Tuscaloosa, Aaron Wise, ABC 3340 News.